In today's video, Daniel Cormier gets mad at Darren Till, Chito Vera talks what's next after UFC San Diego victory, reactions to Chito Vera's spectacular KO of Dominic Cruz, the fighter salaries for UFC San Diego have been revealed, and Rory McDonald seemingly retires from MMA. Daniel Cormier has hit back at Darren Till who suggested DC shouldn't work during the upcoming lightweight title affair between Charles Oliveira and Islam Makhachev. On Saturday, Till tweeted, Charles vs Islam, what a fight, just don't let DC commentate. Cormier expressed his disappointment at Till's statement and replied saying, Darren I expect better from you, I've called multiple teammates fights and honestly my commentary doesn't affect the judges or anything honestly. Most times my team is mad at me because they feel I am too much in other direction. Do better Till. Till replied by writing, I was just joking, I only said it for likes and retweets. Hope to see you there commentating. Cormier responded with, I forget who I was talking to. I'm sorry, I was drunk. LOL. Marlon Vera earned his biggest victory today on Saturday night when he defeated Dominic Cruz by way of knockout at the UFC on ESPN 41 main event. In an interview with UFC News, Vera reacted to his spectacular win and discussed what's next. Here's the clip. Here's some reactions from UFC fighters to Vera's head kick knockout of Dominic Cruz. Aljamain Sterling tweeted, Father Time is truly undefeated. I said before this fight that it may be the passing of the guards. Shido can still take a shot, Cruz, not so much. It's the circle of life in this game. Shido caught him at the right time in both their careers. Great win, hashtag UFC San Diego. Bilal Muhammad wrote, wow, Shido's the man. Henry Cejudo tweeted, Dominic was easily winning that fight 4-0. He leans the head too heavy and it's the same way I knocked him out too. Cheeto won, but I'm not impressed by his performance. Going back too much and getting point fought the whole fight. Cheeto could have finished him a couple times and didn't. Derek Brunson, Cheeto Vera isn't even 30 yet. He should have several good years ahead for himself. Joaquin Buckley wrote, God damn, don't blink. Justin Taffa said sheesh, still mad love to the OG Cruz, just one of those styles where it shows Chito vs Jan would be hectic. Brian Keller tweeted Cruz winning, fighting the perfect fight and just couldn't make a mistake with Chito. Chito can lose the whole fight but find that kill shot at any moment lately. Always dangerous and very hard to hurt. Terrence McKinney said ooh that kick was nasty. Billy Quarantillo wrote, Vera has been on another level, 135 division is so exciting right now, fire. Andre Feely said, happy for my boy Cheeto, love seeing him do good. Followed up with, big respect to Cruz, legend in the sport. And Julian Marquez tweeted, waited for the right opportunity and Cheeto Vera capitalized on it. The head kick that's taking him to the top contender spot. 
UFC San Diego salaries have been revealed. The California State Athletic Commission released the event salary report on Saturday in the aftermath of UFC San Diego. Here are the main card fighter salaries. It's important to note the figures are disclosed payouts only and do not include performance bonuses, discretionary bonuses, or sponsor pay. Marlon Vera cashed a $300,000 purse for the biggest win of his UFC career. Dominic Cruz earned $175,000 in the losing effort. Nate Landwehr made $60,000, including the $30,000 win bonus. And David Onama earned $24,000. Yasmin Hauregi made $50,000, including the $25,000 win bonus, while Yasmin Lucindo made $12,000. Azamat Murzakhanov made $24,000, including the $12,000 win bonus, while Devin Clark made $75,000. Priscilla Cachoeira made $80,000, including her $40,000 win bonus, while Ariane Lipsky made $40K. Gerald Mearsharp made $146,000, including a $73,000 win bonus, while Bruno Silva made $40K. Rory McDonald has seemingly retired from MMA. The former Bellator welterweight champion and UFC contender suffered a devastating loss on Saturday at PFL 8 as he was finished via strikes inside of a round by late notice replacement Delano Taylor. Check out the finish courtesy of PFL's official Twitter account. A little bit too much trying to get the takedown. Look at that side of his nose again. As four losses in five fights now for McDonald, and according to his wife, it could be the last time we saw him inside the octagon. She posted the following image to her Instagram story. So many emotions tonight. I ask that you be kind with your words. It's been a wonderful journey to watch this man fight. Rory has hung up the gloves and very much at peace with it. To new beginnings, thank you. Daddy, did you put your gloves on the ground? Here are the top three memes we found on the internet. Third place meme was found on Instagram and was posted by a user named Strongjaw Fighter. Second place meme was found on Instagram and was posted by a user named The Real Fight Talk. And her top pick was also found on Instagram and was posted by a user named The MMA Doc. Every day we search the internet for the funniest MMA memes and post them to our fan page on Facebook called MMAMemes.com. If you want your meme to be included in our next video, just send it to us in private message on Facebook. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, please leave a like and subscribe to our channel to keep up with the latest MMA news.